Turner's Falls is trying to figure out what to do with a former mill building that was destroyed in a fire last weekend. 22 News reporter Mike Mascadrelli is live at our Franklin County Bureau to tell us the town's plans. Turner's Falls has set a deadline to demolish the burned out building. The former 19th century cotton mill that later became the railroad salvage store burned down on New Year's Eve morning. Turner's Falls Fire Chief John Zellman told 22 News the town notified the property's owners that they had to begin demolishing the building today. He said the town administrator and building inspector agreed with them that what's left of the building was unstable and unsafe and needs to be torn down. It was really sad to hear about uh, an old building being taken down and destroyed by fire. Definitely unsafe now. Yeah, it wasn't. It wasn't really safe before, though. Fire Chief Zellman told 22 News, "If the owners don't start the demolition immediately, the town will start legal action to get the building demolished. The section of Power Road around the building will remain closed until the area is considered safe. The Board of Selectmen will consider what to do about the, the building at their meeting Monday night." Live from the Franklin County Bureau in Greenfield, Mike Mascadrelli, 22 News.